Hello. May God and the heavens watch over you. The Word of God says that a prayer can have great effects, and today I want to pray with you and for you. But before I pray, I need to tell you something. In the things of God, there are no coincidences, either God does it or God allows it, and you are here because God wants to bless you. There is a prayer, among all prayers contained in the Bible, and each psalm is a prayer, and there is a psalm that is a prayer that when you pray it with great faith, with great confidence, and when you repeat this prayer several times, this prayer brings about changes in the scenario, double honor, a time of abundance and prosperity. I am referring to the powerful Psalm 23, one of the strongest and most well-known prayers in the Bible. And today, at this moment, I will be praying with you seven times with this psalm. I don't know if you know, but the number seven is the number of perfection, seven is God's number. The number seven is involved in many miracles in the Bible. The Bible says that God commanded the people to march around the walls of Jericho seven times, and they fell. The Bible says that the prophet commanded Naaman to dip himself in the Jordan River seven times, and Naaman, who had leprosy, was healed. The number seven is a powerful number, it is a number consecrated by God, and this is mentioned in the book of Genesis, right in the early chapters. And today, I will pray with you the 23rd Psalm seven times. Whenever you feel that you are going through struggles in the financial area, listen to this powerful prayer, and you will see that God will open doors, as the Word of God itself says, as He promises, I will go ahead of you, making the crooked places straight, breaking the bronze doors, and shattering the iron bars. I will give you hidden treasures and riches stored in secret places, so you may know that I am the Lord. Write in the comments your first name, followed by the phrase, The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. Everything you say and write gives legality to God in the spiritual world. If you're not subscribed to the channel yet, please subscribe. It's free and activate the notification bell so that every time I post a new video, YouTube will send the prayer to you. Here on our channel, we teach a spiritual routine. It's a very powerful secret. So, welcome, welcome. Let's now pray Psalm 23 with great faith, and I believe that the Lord will bring a change of scenery, a time of prosperity, a time of abundance into your life, Amen. I want you to open your heart, and you can repeat these words with me, either by saying them out loud or mentally, in whichever way you find most comfortable. Shall we pray? The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the righteous paths. For his name's sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me. In the presence of my enemies, you anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the righteous paths. For his name's sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me. In the presence of my enemies, 
you anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the righteous paths. For his name Sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me. In the presence of my enemies, you anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the righteous paths. For his name Sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me. In the presence of my enemies, you anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the righteous paths. For his name Sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me. In the presence of my enemies, you anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the righteous paths. For his name Sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me. In the presence of my enemies, you anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. He refreshes my soul. He guides me along the righteous paths. For his name Sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil. For you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me. In the presence of my enemies, you anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, 
and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Lord, our God, and our beloved and dear Father, in this moment of prayer, we pray now, my Father, under the blessing of the mighty Psalm 23. And I want, my God, to declare a time of victory, a time of prosperity, a time of honor and double honor in the lives of each son, each daughter of the Lord, that my God is here with me praying. May all the promises, Lord, of Psalm 23, come upon the lives of your children. I want to declare every kind of victory. Raise one of your hands and say it with me, I receive the blessings and promises of Psalm 23 upon my life, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Glory to God. Be sure that the Almighty has already provided for your life.